Hi, got a quick question for you. Does your world have more going on in it of what you do want to have happening or what you don't want to have happening? I'm Reverend Allen Beerman, and I welcome you to today's gathering of Metaphysical Ministry International. Now, Metaphysical Ministry is all about explaining how we create our reality. In fact, it's the philosophical part of quantum physics. If you haven't been around for a while, then you know that I'm recovering from vocal cord surgery. So that's why I sound a little odd. But hey, you know, that's my happy share. Something magnificent happened for me today. The universe gave me a song to share. And it didn't just give me a song to share. It gave me a song to share with my guitar, my red electric guitar. It's been three years since the universe has given me the opportunity to do this. Those health issues that we finally found were a brain tumor. They had caused me to lose a feeling in my hand, so I hadn't really been able to play my guitar for about three years. So I'm extremely happy, not only that I can play my guitar, but I think I have enough of a voice today to share the universe. This is a song that it gave me especially to share today because it wouldn't have given me the opportunity if I weren't ready for it, right? So, this is all about what goes on with your imagination. You use your imagination to create your reality deep inside you know that's true your will reflects the thoughts that you put out and exactly how you're feeling about each one together your feelings Manifest in the world as the sum of what goes on inside your head. What if instead of doubt and fear, you think and feel only of what you want to hold near and know it's already here? Just act and find me. Allow it in perfectly and timely. Use your imagination for you. Use your imagination properly to become who you want to be and clearly see your dreams become your reality. Use your imagination for you. Use your imagination for you. Use your imagination for you. And what do I mean by that? When you're creating your thoughts by what you're creating your world by the thoughts that are going on inside your head, yes? And it's the thoughts to which you're adding feelings, emotions that the universe is recognizing as what you want to manifest. The universe doesn't know if it's something desirable for you. The universe doesn't know if it's good for you or bad for you. All the universe knows is it's here to serve you. So if you're thinking thoughts and you're feeling really good, you're going to manifest that into your reality pretty quickly. And if you're thinking thoughts and you're feeling really cruddy, you're going to manifest that into your world pretty quickly also. So there are two parts to manifesting what you do want in your world instead of what you don't want. First of all, notice how you're feeling. Think the thought of what you desire in your world, of what you want in your reality. And know 
with 100% certainty that it has already come to pass. Because as you're putting out that message and the universe is seeing that you're sure that it's your reality, it's going to provide synchronistic events. But you got to act on them. You don't just say, this is what I want, I'm going to think about it. And here comes the life of my dreams. Oh, the universe provides everything that you need to do so that you get to manifest your desires. So be aware of the thoughts you're thinking because a lot of people will think, oh, I want to attract a new mate, a new partner who really, really understands me and who really loves me and treats me well. And then you immediately go to, oh, but I've never been able to do that before. I don't know if I can do that now. You've immediately canceled out all of your belief, all of your knowing, it's gone. The universe is only going to give you what it knows you know is in your possible future. And the thing is, anything and everything is possible when you know it is. Hey, I didn't know I was going to sing a song today. Could I have sung it better? Sure. Will I sing it better? Yes. But the fact is, I sang a song while playing my guitar. I'm really happy about it. I really am. So, if there's something that you'd like to manifest in your world, think the thought. Know with 100% certainty it's yours. Look for all the opportunities the universe will bring to you, act on them. And if you want to get some extra help, you alone have the power. It's inside you when you do those steps I just mentioned. And if you want some extra help to keep you on track, go ahead and fill in your name down below and what it is you want. And I will put it up there on the Hold a Spaceport page. And what that does is everybody who comes to that page reads your name, well, every name that's on the list, and what you want us to see you realizing in your life as your reality. That thought form gets bigger, and you tell your family, and you tell your friends to come back here, and you come back here every few days and read through the whole list of each name and what people want to have happen in their reality. And it will keep you focused, because the way to get what you want is to stay focused on the one thing you want. Do one thing at a time, so you don't lose sight of what you want. I'm so glad you came by today. I'm so very, very glad to be able to share my music with you. I know it's going to get better and easier. and easier to listen to me too. Anyway, if you haven't already done so, please go over there and get your copy of how to take your first steps on your spiritual path. And I really appreciate your clicking share and like and letting other people know about Metaphysical Ministry International because they just may well be on their spiritual journey and they're looking for something that's spiritual, but not in any way, shape, or form religious. Enjoy a very wonderful week, paying attention to how you're using your imagination. Blessings.